Oi lads, it's Danny here today, bring you lot a lovely video. In today's video, we're going to take a look at how to solve the integral of cotan of x dx. So before we begin, I want you lot to leave a like and subscribe, and let's get right into it then. So the first step that you lot need to do is rewrite the cotan in terms of cos and sine, and we can use a lovely trig identity to do that. And the one we need is this one right here. So we're going to basically rewrite it with cos of x in the numerator and sine of x in the denominator. Once it's been written in this form, we can then apply a technique from calculus 2 known as the u substitution. We are going to take the u to be equal to sine of x. And once we have done that, we basically then take the derivative on both sides of this equation. So on the left hand side you're going to be left with du and on the right hand side you're going to be left with cos of x dx which is basically the derivative of sine of x. Right so we're going to rewrite it in terms of d of x so once you have done that you are going to have du divided by cos of x. We are going to take this dx and replace it back inside the integral and once we have done that we are going to have an expression that looks like an integral that looks like this rather and over here this here is the u variable we are replacing sine with u don't forget and straight away we can simplify this integral cos of x in the numerator and the denominator are going to cancel out and what you are going to be left with is just a, a simple integral of the integral of 1 divided by u du we all know that that's going to be equal to ln absolute value of u plus some constant c now what's left to do is basically to replace this sine of x where the u variable is and that's the answer to this problem. So if you lot enjoyed this video please leave a like and subscribe and I'll see you lot later.